Japan Journal, the Internet's number one English language weekly online cybercast from Japan. Japan Journal with Mal Adams. Good day, everyone, and welcome once again to another edition of Japan Journal. I'm your host, Mal Adams, here with the inimitable, the very famous, the very soulful, and Kimochi Pai, no <laughs> jazz man, Toku. In the house, yo, 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 This is just after rehearsal. Yo, my, my yeah, I got my, I'm, I'm, I'm cool, I'm cool. Otsukarizama desu. Hontoni ureshi yo kyo wa. I takata, man. I wanted to meet you and uh, uh, long man, time ago. Man, I don't wonder why we didn't meet. So Maybe we passed. You're talking about Body and Soul in Tokyo yeah. and yeah. Rob Crocker. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to show him this. <laughs> And Caleb, you mentioned Caleb, new face, Warito. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's mm -hmm. a new buddy, a nice pianist, man. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, uh, let's play together. Uh, is that so? September. Uh huh. Okay, I, I see the battery is running here. We'll go as far as we can. Then I'll use it on this one here. Okay. But uh, Niigata, mm -hmm. this one, you from? So this. Yeah, yeah. Donna ka kuni desu. Inaka desu ka. Inaka, Inaka. <laughs> okay. Inaka. Well, 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 where I grew up, it's called a Sanjo City. Mm -hmm. It's the uh, third biggest, fourth biggest, or well, anyway, Inaka. Mm -hmm. And uh, um, my dad, that's uh, uh, he's a he's a big, probably the biggest influence of my life. In what way? In music. In music, was he a musician? He actually not professional, mm -hmm. but. He started uh, running the studio, mm -hmm. recording in the rental studio mm -hmm. for the first time, the uh, first time in, in the city, um, mm -hmm. in, in town. Mm -hmm. And in the, that was the beginning of the 80s. I was uh, about third, fourth grade. Um, well, actually, what my, my house, uh, the, uh, the first the house I grew up, mm -hmm. uh, 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 um, Got um, what the mayor of the city? I mean, the city wanted to make a road on. The okay, so, so in English, what well, eminent domain? Safe no time ni idou shinai to ne sa no subushite mata michi skuru mina no time ni arakana. So in America, more arimasu yo. I guess my, you know, he got he got um, some money from yeah. the city, but never so enough, Tisha. I don't think so. Tari nai ne. Well, anyway, yeah, I guess ah. Uh, he, but if, anyway, he wanted to build a, the first studio for the young people who, who are were trying to play music. Great. Yeah, and he, he, my dad wanted to support them, yeah. and then I, I didn't know about that. I, I had no idea about that like until like you know many many years later. Well, you said you well, were four it, years old. Four years old. Yeah, I was no, I was fourth grade. Oh, fourth grade. I see. Old, yeah. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Then we yeah we moved to this this new place and mm -hmm. uh, uh, then he built a studio and a house too. And uh, 
Uh, well, anyway, I grew up uh, with watching the older the high school children, also businessmen, uh, through night and day, uh, the coming by, you know, the studio. Jamming. It's a practice. Practice. Practice, yeah, because there was, it was uh, uh, the band. The band was uh, like main, like, you know, the trendy thing yeah. you know, at the time. Okay. So many uh, many people are trying to to play the band. What genre are we talking about? Rock, the show? Folk. Rock, pop, pop, yeah, folk, folk. Yeah. They're for Japan mm -hmm. right now. Okay. And also, even here was a recording. Artist. Yeah, some, some, yeah, some amateur band. band. Great, yeah. great. And the, every weekend. Mm. Also, uh, he, he, he was playing, he was playing uh, himself. Uh, 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 he started playing the bluegrass music when, in, in his college. Okay. So he plays on the guitar, mandarin, banjo, violin. Banjo, much yeah, on yeah. for bluegrass, right? Mm -hmm. Before that, you know, he grew up with the Beatles, of course, mm -hmm. when he was in, in high school. Oh. So yeah, he was playing rock and roll music. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, um, my the, uh, my dad's band, bluegrass band. Yeah came to my house and uh, they were not every weekend but um, um at least like you know one or two weekends mm. yeah a month they came over to my house and they were jamming all night so i grew up with that <laughs> okay so great. well yeah i was surrounded by my music great. you know a you know, lot of music but uh, i was uh, playing soccer i really loved playing soccer <laughs> I, I was an outside boy in, oh. in my elementary school but uh, when i and got up into a junior high school, they didn't have a soccer club. So I always liked to listen to the music. So I went to check out the brass band club. Then I look around, oh, I want to play that. That was that. In, in junior high school? In junior high school. No, Bukatsu. That was basically so, so, so Bukatsu. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So basically, the, uh, yeah, my trumpet. Actually, that was cornet. Yeah. Cornet. I don't know why the reason, uh, the reason why I chose that one, but um, my dad, uh, is uh, also a huge uh, jazz fan, mm. and uh, he took whole family to the Miles Davis concert. No way! Yeah, Go when he <laughs> came to my hometown, what? actually it was a near the city. It, I was in the city, and I was fourth grade, I remember, and uh, that was first and last time. Yeah, oh, when I Miles, see. Miles, he came to my. My, my hometown, uh, and uh, it was a part of a Live Under the Sky thing. Wait a minute, and I was going to ask, what year was that? Uh, Live Under the Sky? Oh man, yeah. I, I was with Miles at that oh, time. I'm looking uh, for, I was, we, he took me to Osaka, yeah. CNN of the man. Uh, and uh, we hit it off so well, we hit it off this guy, yeah, I'm talking about this guy. <laughs> yeah. That's your boy, see, because you got that feeling, right? Miles. Yeah, man, he'd take me on tour just so I could shoot I cover his thing for CNN. Uh -huh. Because he hated the mass communist. He hated the press. That's what I heard. But he said, Mal, you, you should have been a musician. I said, why is that, Mal? He said, because you listen. Mm -hmm. You don't talk so much. You listen. Uh -huh. I said, okay, I got you. I said, in my next life, I'll be, be a jazz pianist, you know. So he, how, what was oh. your impression? Um, uh, he was loud, and my dad was really excited. <laughs> That's all I remember. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, you know, but somehow, somehow, something but inside. But somehow, you. yeah, something remained in my somewhere, you know, <laughs> and uh, maybe that, yeah, that's why I chose playing cornet. But I was not not good student. Okay. I, was, I was just like trying to play like Miles, and I found this harmony mute. You know what harmony is? You really change the sound yes, of the sure, trumpet, sure, sure, sure. like you know, mute, mute it's sound. Part of the miles, you know, thing. That's right. And, uh, and I'm like, uh, I was uh, listening to the, uh, the his '80s music, cause, uh, you know, in, in, you know. Yeah, he in bumped it up a little bit. Yeah. When I was in junior high school, and uh, trying to, you know, play like. I just heard the recording and played like, you know, right. trying to play like some Miles' line. Yeah. And, and uh, when when everybody got together, like I was just, I couldn't read music. I really couldn't <laughs> any of it because, of, well, I got perfect pitch, so I always n knew uh, that what, what I should play. Sure you I was right. just, yeah, listening to the to the next guy and this was I was right. copying lines right. so you know. 
Yeah, you create the harmony, you create the intervals, and you know the relationships, right? Yeah, I could be uh, the first, the second, third, fourth, any position. You yeah. could take over, huh? Yeah. See, that's like black people yeah. on vocals. We can always we harmonize together. You get a four guys yeah. harmonizing. Yeah. Natural, man. Mm -hmm. natural. So you had that kind of ear. That yeah. is so blessed, brother. That's, that's key to you. But I stopped playing my horn in, in my high school. I started playing Mahjong. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. It's more than, than Mahjong, you know. Uh, in high of, course school? I, of course, at that time I didn't know the, the tune called the Majan by Wayne Shorter in the Up. 60s. <laughs> you know what? But anyway, so this um, uh, then I, some guys, uh, probably only a uh, few guys were, were doing the band, mm -hmm. you know, with the uh, Majan, Majan guys, you know, okay. Majan, you know this, this Majan group. Not the Shumi. Anyway, I, I, got, I bought like, uh, a second hand electric bass from this guy and I started playing the bass. And mm. I, then, then I started playing the drums, and what? I started uh, started doing the, the two bands in my high school. Also, one punk band outside of my school. <laughs> I was a drummer. Yeah. Okay. That's easy. not like it's like some complicated stuff. Oh, well, anyway, not not like jazz yeah, at all. Yeah. Okay. Um. <laughs> then uh, uh, let's see. Right, well, anyway. Um, I couldn't practice free because uh, you know my dad had a studio at, at home, so nice. I always uh, you know the, brought the key and you know <laughs> the practicing in the studio. Well, anyway, and I failed all the exams for college, and I had to spend one year before college, you know, just for studying. You know, that's what what um, most young. What do, know, do, what, do, what do you call it in Japanese? Nantoka. Roninsei. Roninsei. So Roninsei. 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 Oh, man. And a little bit singing. Uh, the copy band of, of Beatles. I was playing I playing know. bass and singing. Wow. That's Paul McCartney. And, uh, <laughs> well, I started uh, working at a tiny CD shop because uh, I needed a part-time job. And uh, Still in my, your hometown? No, 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 no. Tokyo. My, uh, my, uh, in Tokyo. I was, yeah. My, I, my college was in, in Saitama. Saitama, right. Okay. Almost Tokyo, almost. So I read that. Nani to Tokyo International so International University. University, yeah. Yeah. It was Nani Tokyo, though. <laughs> but you had a, a no, American or Seattle, Portland, Oregon, Portland. Portland. You Portland. went to Portland and studied English, right? I was right? in Portland. Uh, Portland. Uh, Portland. Uh, Portland. Uh, uh, Portland. Uh, my college was, was in Salem City, mm -hmm. in Oregon State. Oh. Yeah. Well, I had to pass the exam, but uh, I wanted to go there. So it's it's a uh, exchange exchange program, exchange right? Program and also yeah, that was really great program for studying English. I wanted to study. I really I was really um, curious about learning learning the other language. Sure. So mm. well, anyway, I passed the exam and uh, I went uh, for one year. Stayed in Salem, this small city <laughs> know, in man. Oregon country. But, uh, but uh, then I had a roommate, American roommate, okay. and. Uh, Great jazz piano player, jazz piano player, and uh, and uh, I uh, uh, he found my uh, trumpet case, and on the first day I got there, and uh, he was like, okay, I played the piano, okay, let's go jam, and uh, well, I started playing with my roommate's band once a week, wow. every Thursday night, in the ca in the cafe of this. Campus. Oh, the campus. I see. Uh huh. That was a great experience. Was I it jazz? Went there was to jazz? study English. Yeah. Jazz. Yeah. Straight ahead. Okay. But, uh, but at the time, I just you know, I just started playing jazz. Oh, uh, you know, I, 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 I said I started working in a little tiny tiny CD, CD shop. shop, right? Yeah. Hmm. I found uh, it was it was a whole jazz jazz section was like this, like well, thirty CDs. I but see. But one of them was a Miles Davis. It's wow. called the, the Mute. Miles Davis. It was a compilation album by uh, from uh, all the 50s uh, recordings with a Harmon, uh, Harmon yeah. piano. Yeah, mute. Yeah. On, yeah. Well, well, anyway, I, I really liked one of the tracks. It's called uh, If I Are Bell, which is the first track of the relaxing album. I see. Yeah, and then I 
copied all the minor things, the solo, didn't even know that was the improvisation. Then one day, this guy heard me play the Miles, Miles lines, yeah. uh, which I copied, <laughs> and he took me to the where he was playing with his piano tour every Friday night. He was a drummer. And uh, I just sat in and uh, played the exactly same as Miles Davis, right? Oh, man. Because that's, that's the only line I could play. The piano player goes, oh, you play with, uh, uh, you, you play exactly same as Miles Davis did. And I was like, and what does that mean? You know, what do you mean? You know, yeah. don't you know that was improvisation? <laughs> yeah. Improvisation? Right. Huh? No. Improvisation? No. I was so, like, so, so, damn. So. Really? There's and no sheet like, music with that melody on it. Nowhere. Shit. Yeah, that's come from his head, right? Well, but I feel like, it, uh, the f I, like uh, I finally found what I really want to do. I see. Yeah. Well, since then, you know, I've been living for that. Wow. It was, yeah, it was that's great. A deep, that's a deep story. So then, then I went to study English, but, you know, I had a great opportunity, great chance to play with my roommate's band. Yeah. Yeah, once a week while I was there. And that was, was better than studying English, actually, because you got the real conversation, real yeah, time. And yeah. You had to understand, sure. Yeah. That was a real conversation through playing. So, yeah. Took you ten years to reach this level of proficiency now in English, maybe, or in five, English? five years, yeah, because of the college years. After, and well, I got better. My in English skill got better after I came back here. Thank Especially, you. I started hanging out with Tommy Campbell. Uh, oh God! Oh, okay. you, oh my right? God! Tommy Campbell is Wait my, till he my sees partner. this video, man. Okay. Yeah, so oh, yeah? I know we must you know, have met, man, somewhere. He, you know, he lived in, in Tokyo for 13 years. I was and, with uh, him a lot of that time. Lot and, uh, yeah. You know, so. he introduced me many people, and uh, you know, he 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 played with like um, Sony Rollins. Good man, Sato San Daiju, Ato Nampu. Okay, both in English, huh? Okay, okay, okay. And, uh, so we got three minutes. Tommy Campbell, who yeah, else we were talking about back in the day in, in, in the mm -hmm. Roppongi? Yeah, when we were, we were hanging out a lot. We started okay. hanging out a lot. And, uh, that explains it. Man. Many, many musicians. And, uh, yeah. Then, uh, you know, you, like every time we we meet at the Blue Note and he introduced me to musicians. Sure. And, and uh, the regular course is uh, going to the Body and Soul, which is sure. the on the, the North. And okay, I'm there. gonna name a pianist's yeah. name, and if you know this guy, I know I met you or we were there at the same time. Tsuyoshi. Yeah! Hey, yeah that's that. my brother, man. Tsuyoshi. Yes, Tsuyoshi. Oh, yeah, my, he's my mentor. He, yeah, he's he my jazz. Lots of things in there through playing. I love that guy like Not a brother. Not worse, man. you know, with his playing. Sure, he's, sure. Oh. He made me think I could play. He said, man, you got sense. You could play. I said, man, I can't play no play. <laughs> so to this day, yeah. I'm tinkling around. I'm reading it. I don't look at the melody. I yeah. sing the melody and play the chords uh -huh. with rhythm. Yeah, with rhythm. And I'm on, baby. That's it. Because I'm, I'm feeling good.
Let me just we, we run out of time to, to call it. So, uh, your latest project is is that the uh, Stevie Wonder cover album? My latest one is uh, 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 the the album called The Shake, which was released last year, 2017. Okay. I did all the collaboration with the musicians. I met uh, and so I've met in this. 18 years since my debut. Foreign and all Japanese? The yeah, all, yeah. Mm -hmm. all the different genres. I see. Ghost Gloves, Maki Ogro, uh, 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 Sugizo, the guitar player from X Japan, also on Donasi. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, also, uh, well, many, many people. So, one more word about the Stevie project. Uh, yeah. uh, you love this guy, huh? You said you were impressed by him. Wow. Man, that's, that's, that's your brother Mal and sure. Stevie, right? <laughs> they insert that. I was fourth grade. I was in my grandma's room. And yeah. She had a, this cassette deck. And uh, my dad used to listen to one of his albums called the Music Creerium. Oh, yeah. Uh, Very yeah. nice. Yeah, right? Yeah. Rare one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a great completion album. Mm -hmm. And, uh, well, I was uh, playing an album and uh, the, the song called That Girl. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very nice, very nice. Song. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, I don't know how, but I, you know, anyway, his music, his, you oh. know, his, his vibe. It's in you, huh? Yeah, you you give a very nice interpretation, man. I was totally impressed with that, and uh, so I said I gotta find this guy and find out who. So I'm not surprised that we've crossed paths, maybe mm -hmm. back in at the yeah. Body and Soul yeah. somewhere with Mama yeah. San and all the cats and Yamamoto Tsuyoshi, man. Come on, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's too small of a world, huh? Yeah. So kore kara yoroshiku onegaishimasu. I will be following you and mata interview shitai kara. I will be here tomorrow if we have time. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm coming. Do give me some another ten minutes, man, so I can finish. Sure. A little bit rushed, you know. Yeah. And I'll bring one of my staff. Uh, we'll mm -hmm. after the show or whatever you suggest. Sure. Now, konya wa Mal's bar, moto ima Mama's bar, kanai no namae de. I'm in taista kara. Tanshin dokshin na chatsukas. The free. So, but tonight we have our annual Halloween cosplay party, DJ party. She said to invite you. And uh, if you have time, but I know you're busy, man. We'll do that. She'll be happy to see this interview. Uh, so, one stotso, stokoto, I, Kimie san, and Alisa chan wa musume de. I shall stick to Alisa chan. Hello, talk to this. And Kimie san? Yes. Right? Yeah. Kimie san, talk to this. Yeah. I heard that you sometimes come come to my show, and, and I really thank you yeah. for coming out. Yeah. And, uh, uh, Enjoy my music. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hello, everybody at Mama's Bar. Hello, everybody from Mama's Bar. Talk to this. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that's going to do it for this edition of Japan Journal, everybody. I'm your host, Mal Adams, here in the presence of the inimitable, the great, the very soulful. Toku, number one jazz man in Japan right now, in my opinion. <laughs> okay. You're a bad boy, man. I appreciate the time. Thank you. I will see you Thank tomorrow you. at the live. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. after that, let's talk some more. You know what mm -hmm. Okay, man. Thank you. That's going to do you. it. Thank you. 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 Japan Journal, the Internet's number one English language weekly online cybercast from Japan. Japan Journal with Mao Adams.